Okay guys, well, I figured I'd do a, a full video of my Xbox uh, 360 controller CNC mod. Um, this mod cost me 16 bucks. That's it. The cost, the price of this uh, controller off eBay used. Um, it's not a clone, it's a real Microsoft one. Um, and uh, 16 bucks shipped to my door and now I have a uh, nice controller to operate my CNC machine. So the way it works is because the Xbox is Microsoft native, um, it runs off USB. So you just plug it into your computer for the first time. And depending on your computer, um, it will recognize and install the drivers automatically for this controller. If not, Mach, Mach 3 support has a, uh, has a section for the plug-in and the download for the drivers for this. So it's, it's no big deal. All you got to do is go to Mach 3's website, and, uh, which is Mach support. Com, so and then go to the plugins anyways the benefit to me of having this is just to eliminate the keyboard uh, obviously I'm not going to take the keyboard away but um, I don't have to reach over while I'm trying to find my zero my home my home spot um, this way the cords pretty long I can walk around the machine with this um, so after you download the drivers or if you install it and everything's working um, and you put the, the plugin inside the Mach 3 folder in the Mach 3 plugins folder in your C drive um, you run the, the plugin, it'll install it, and then when you run Mach 3, it'll import it. So um, after you get it running, you just run the uh, the, the plugin command um, in Mach 3, and then you just go to your Xbox controller, hit config, set all the options you want. So you can set all the buttons to whatever function you want the machine to do. So right now, here's mine. Here's how I got mine set up. My left joystick, I have it to my X and Y control. So. It's controlling my X and Y. You can see that. Real nice. I like that. And how much pressure you put on the joystick is how fast the machine is going to move. So if I go a little bit with the, with the, with the joystick, my machine is going to go slower or faster. So slower, faster. So I have my left joystick controlling my X and Y. My right joystick controls the A, my fourth axis, and my Z. Um, I don't have my fourth axis. Well, it's there, but it's not. You can't see anything. So, but my Z would be like that. So I just go up and down with my joystick, and the same thing applies with the pressure. How much I push will go slower or faster. Real nice. I like that. I like that feature. Um, then these other buttons you could set for like your zeroing. I got my red button for stop. I got my A button for zeroing all. Um, I've got my blue button for going home, so I'll go home, I'll hit the blue, the X button. Now I went home, they went right to where I set my, uh, my machine, so I'll go ahead and I'll set my machine again. Okay, I'm going to zero all, hit A. You hear Mach 3 accept it, it zeroed everything up on my uh, program. And then uh, I can move it around where I want, then I'll just go home going home. I got this other, I got the, the start button that actually cycle starts. I got the back button that actually rewinds it so you, I could hit stop, rewind, and it'll go it'll set the G code back to the beginning. Um, I got these shoulder buttons up here um, for little things like free hold, um, something else too, I don't remember, but um, refer all home, why it'll go home. It'll uh, do it'll go all the home switches activation. So and then here I got my micro steps here. So um, but yeah, it's, it's it works flawless. Um, now I could I could walk way over there now. Guys do a wireless on here, but you got to buy a wireless receiver, and it's like sixty bucks. So um, I wanted to get into it with, uh, cheap as possible, just to understand. It. And who knows, maybe down the line I'll do a I'll do a, a wireless version of it. Um, but but you know, with all the functions that I have set up on here now, there, there's really no use for me to have the keyboard as far as operating the CNC. Um, there may be a couple features on there that I could use, but um, with all these extra buttons on here, everything I need, Mach 3, 4 is here. Um, oh, I know, my, my Y button, actually up top, the orange Y or yellow, however you want to look at it, it starts my spindle. See, watch. I got the, the controller set up with Mach 3 to start my spindle on and off. So that's what I can do, I just start it. Or Mach 3, whenever you cycle start, whenever you cycle start, it'll start the, the, the spindle also.
So, but that's it. Mach 3 with uh, Xbox 360 controller. Works flawlessly. Love it.